Well, my next guest has 30 ASCAP songwriting awards, seven number one records, 14 top 10 hits, 22 albums to his credit. He's just got a brand new one, and we like him here on Opry backstage for his music, but especially his hot sauce. Oh, <laughs> comment ça va, mon ami? Toujours ça va bien. <laughs> Eddie Raven is here. Tu parles français et espagnol, huh? Yeah, that's it. I'm telling you, I like that. We will explain all this and we, a little later on. <laughs> Maybe they have the little translators crawl across the bottom of the screen for us I like the little pigs here. used to run across there. <laughs> I like that. Well, living in black and white is what you're doing to, that's today, it. these days, that's musically. It. And it's a, a new album, and there's a lot of things that people need to know about it, especially how they can get it now and when it'll be available in stores. Probably, uh, And you can see yeah. it. People can see it up on screen there. Yeah, I got little pictures there. It'll be, uh, uh, you can get it on our, on our website, which is uh, eddyraven.com, E-D-D-Y. Mm -hmm. And uh, we should have it out... Uh, we're, we're looking at probably the first of the year before we get all our pieces together. But you but can go ahead and get it yeah, online you get it now. Off there. We're getting all our distribution together now to try to get it right. And the label is Row Music Group. Yeah. Is that we you it, or yeah. is that a group of friends? Or? That's uh, four of us, my friends. How about that? Family and friends. Well, there's a great <laughs> song on here, Hearing It in French. Ain't that good? That is so good. Everything sounds better when you're hearing it in French. Because and people. It, when you're drinking. <laughs> <laughs> this is. <laughs> This is also the fellow who gets the, the writer's credit for Thank God for Kids, and that probably is something that continues in your career. People keep continue to mention that to you, because it's so powerful. Well, it's one you. for the ages. It's uh, the best song I've ever written. It's by far the most successful song, and undoubtedly the best song, because it's about the best thing there is. I mean, it's, yeah. it's a lot of meat in that song, as Lefty would say. Was that an inspir I mean, was it inspired by an event in your life? Or, yeah. or was it just one of those things where well, you got... I was, I'm the oldest of 10, and uh, I have two boys, and uh, yeah, that always, you know, it always bothered me when, uh, to, see how, to see how kids get pushed away and run, you know, and even going in any of the, the, the McDonald's or the Burger Kings, you'll see a kid standing at the counter, you know, and then they don't even see him, you know. Yeah. But uh, I was coming back uh, from a trip in the, with Johnny Duncan, and uh, in the Smokies, and we stopped, and these kids were running up and down the side of this mountain, make it real short, uh, in the rest area, and uh, John said, man, look at those kids. I used to have that kind of energy, and I said, yeah, thank God for kids, and John said, that's a song, you need to write it. How about that? And I, I added it to the list of other song ideas I'd had, we had had that day on the back of a Winn-Dixie grocery bag, <laughs> and wrote it in about 15 minutes once I got home and got on it. And the simplicity of Kool-Aid on the couch, what parents can't relate to that. That's either. right. You're going to write with Mark Colley and Toby Keith here yeah. next week. I'd love to be in on that session. Just not to write, just to hang around and listen. Oh, it'd be fun. <laughs> They're two great guys, you know, and, and I haven't uh, spent much time with, uh, with, uh, with Toby or Mark, but I have uh, a little bit, and they're great guys, and mm -hmm. I'm looking forward to that. It's going to be fun. Well, before you get away, Eddie Raven's Mexican Gourmet Sauce. Oh, yeah. Now, what, I mean, what's in here? Come on. Uh, it's got, uh, <laughs> it's got uh, fresh squeezed garlic juice, it's got cayenne, it's got tomato puree, it's got a lot of other little things like that. It's not just, uh, it's not just salt and, you know, it's, and vinegar and stuff. It's got vinegar, but it's not, it's good. How long did it take you to arrive at that? <laughs> I mean, to perfect uh, it? Not long. <laughs> <laughs> You've had a lot of practice. I've lived it. <laughs> it's in your heritage. Well, stay with us. In about one minute, <laughs> little Jimmy Dickens is going to take Opry Center stage. And that's always an event. His guests include the Kinleys and this man, Eddie yes. Raven. Well,